sort of bully Zelda um, just by like kind of approach, kind of approaching forward in the air, um, and kind of and pushing her to the corner. Yeah, Not one to of say Zelda's that best tools in this matchup is actually Phantom. Oh yeah, absolutely. Um, it will be very difficult to uh, put out given uh, all the small projectiles Samus can throw. Right. Okay. We're getting right into it. Um, Solo is jumping out to a quick lead here. Um, a really nice up tilt to neutral air on that. Seeing her uh, using that reflector to make Reese love. Yeah. I expect her to throw that out a lot more than usual in this match. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, and yeah, it's really like, you certainly should do it at least somewhat. Oh, nice catch on the, she, uh, on a, yeah, nice punish on that up here. E. Okay, wow. Really strong start from Summer. Oh. Tried to force a stage tech scenario there, but yeah, Chas is very good at ledge trapping by catching a lot of options by throwing out Samus's forward air. Yeah. Really covers a lot of options. Zelda takes more three struggles to get off ledge. Oh yeah, yeah. Without a spacing aerial, it's like really like Zelda just like has like limited to the options that the game gives you on the ledge, which are extremely limited. <laughs> yep. Oh, nice! Ref that little baby um, charge shot reflect kick. into the into the forward air is going to give Solaros the early stock lead here. Ending with Nehru's love. Okay. Yeah, so far I'm seeing, uh, so far I think Summer's doing a really good job uh, catching Chas's landings. Um, especially since it seems to be coming down with forward air a lot. So she's like, she can run back with like dash back F smash, like maybe charge Phantom and just have it cut, like charge it so it covers the spot right where he lands. Um, and is getting, she's getting a lot of damage off that. Okay, sends a Phantom the wrong way. Yeah, without uh, doing a Phantom Ooh. displacement. Then yeah. you get the upper direction helps by uh, putting up a wall between Zelda and the uh, exactly yeah. Samus. There was a really interesting scenario there on the ledge where Chas had a force. Chas actually tried to force smash, put out a bomb, and um, Solaris reflected it. And Chas tried to forward smash, which was just a little bit too far. But he had the right idea there. I think that was a really good bait, trying to put out the bomb there and force a reflect. Really missing the uh, the card shot there. Yeah, about one fifty percent. Solaris, excuse me, is taking uh, taking quite a big lead here. Gas has got to find something. I guess Samus just kind of struggled to kill in a sense without like charge shot. She does have um, neutral air and forward air are, and I guess back air too are like decent kill options. But they're oh catches her with the full charge shot. Nice charge shot. Yeah, caught the caught. The, I think the ledge jump there or was it neutral? Yeah. All right, using the uh, vulnerability from neighbors love to uh, avoid the the grab. Yeah. And right there, I want. Um, I almost wonder if Chas could have gotten another forward air after that first one, especially since that low percent. Oh, Ooh. I don't know what happened there. I think maybe I'm Chas sure. burned his double ju double jump unnecessarily. Um, he's just trying to go out to get going, trying to go out to get Solar. So it's kind of unfortunate. But even still, he's uh, racking up a lot of damage. He might even this up uh, like as we speak. <gasps> nice catch with the uh, up air. This just matchup in particular, both characters struggle to uh, kill each other despite all the damage. They yeah, that's true. So both floaties live forever. Of them are Wow, really nice. Chas evening it right back up. That SD meant nothing, clearly. and Because this is a dead even game now. And Chas actually taking the advantage. <gasps> nice catch with the up tilt on the air dodge in. Wow, this is a quite a big turnaround now. Oh, okay, yeah. He comes down with the landing aerial, and, and Solaros is all over that. This is. Oh, doesn't get that grab on the roll. I think Chas is quickly uh, adapting to uh, Solaros' landing with uh, Neighbor's Love. Yeah. And that's Ooh, the thing, right? Like that, and that's it with the upbeat too. Nice, yeah. And that's really Zelda's biggest weak. That's really what you got. What? Wow, that killed! I am that shocked. That must have been some bad DI. Yeah, I guess so, because I've never seen and, like uh, up here strong, but it's not but that not strong. even all the hits connected there. I think. Yeah. But... Wow, what a comeback from Chaz! Weird, yeah. He was kind of down for all of that game, um, but just kind of slowly but surely um, brought himself back with some really strong, yeah. some really strong and grounded neutral. Yeah, it seems like he. Uh, Learned a lot of Solar Rose's normal get-up and landing options. Yeah. Quickly took advantage of that. Right, and that's what you need to do against Zelda, right? Because landing, la Zelda's arguably biggest weakness, in my opinion, is landing. Because she doesn't really have, like, a good get-off-me aerial. Like, like she no. can low prowl with fair and bear, but, like, those are, yeah, those are very terrible. Uh, left. Comparing that to Samus's tools of her forward air and up air. Exactly, yeah. Which definitely outreach a lot of what uh, Zelda can do. I have to play? Okay. okay. I'm going to hop off commentary right now for our man Hugh, Bye. but I will see you all around. Oh. Yeah, lost a mic here.
That's good. All right. Oh no, we got Sans. Oh. oh no. Running it back on PS2. I'm gonna try not to be uh, biased. I do yeah. hate Samus, but you know. Well, you know what? I'm trying not to be biased here too. All right. So here's the thing about this matchup. Okay. Here's what Samus wants to do. Basically, Samus. The, both these characters are pretty similar, actually. They're trying to set up their wall and then get you to like, 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 uh, uh kind of. Oh, there's the the F smash jank I was well, talking yeah. about earlier. Oh, uh, what happened? Um, Zelda's F smash can actually pull other people in, and if they put out a hitbox, it can pull the hitbox in and then cancel the uh the F smash. Are you talking about Zelda's? Yep. Really? Zelda's F smash can pull people in. Well, I knew that, but uh, and if you have a hitbox, that just kind of it just pulls it in, it. and then you yeah. get hit. Mm -hmm. That's kind of weird. Okay, no, also, but what I was saying is, what I was saying is, this matchup, both these characters are kind of kind of have the same goal, right? They're trying to they're trying to to do something, and then to get you to jump, right? They both want you to jump, so that they can hit you with their long lasting aerial moves, right? What Zelda's trying to do is is like make you not want to be on the ground, right? So that she can just like throw out an air or something in the air and kill you, or this phantom, right? Uh, just trying to uh, condition you into being in the air. Uh, Samus does the same fucking thing. Samus is, is charging the charge shot, and you know, oh, that charge shot, it could always hit me, so I'm gonna jump, and then he forward airs you, right? That's what Samus does. Uh, and it, really, whoever is better at covering the, the grounded options really is, is, is gonna win this matchup, because uh, if you're really good at covering the ground, right, then they're gonna be convinced to jump more, and that's what you want, right? Um, Cast taking the first stock here with enough air. Yeah, uh, uh, calling out calling out the aerial option because uh, forcing Soul Rose to go high. Uh, now Chas has no jump here, uh, but does make it back. That was good. She yeah. outspaced the fair. It's just yeah, very Soul very Rose hard. Is very good at uh, facing her F smash on the left. <laughs> bro, bro, she just fucking forward smash, back up options. forward smash. You know, you know. Yep. <laughs> no, nah, but uh, <laughs> uh, really, uh, see you see how how Samus is forced to jump there. Uh, Summer has to to cover those options better. But uh, right now, right now, Chaz is doing slightly better covering the jumps here. Uh, that beer burst was good. Gonna keep catching Zelda with that up air. Yeah. Oh, puts himself in disadvantage. That's not yeah. good. Uh, if Summer can... Oof, that wasn't good. Oh. So, Summer kind of yeah. went for something... Samus was in a pretty good spot to recover. It, it, it was going to be kind of hard for Summer to hit that downer no matter what. It was kind of not the greatest decision. Uh, but yeah. Okay. Ooh, yeah, see, covering that jump with the long lasting aerial is really the name of the game here. Catching the. Uh... Ooh. Oh, he's Solar's dead. going really deep on that. Yeah, one, but, uh, but then, but then really Chaz tried to. to do the reverse edge guard, but uh, he kind of died for it. So, but it's okay since he's up so much. It's not too big of a deal unless he kind of chokes a, li a little bit here, uh, or Summer gets a couple reads in a row. Th those neutral bees are really trying to land a lot. With yeah. The, uh, so, so the empty land neutral bee. I'm sure you know about the empty land neutral bee. It's very good against a character like Samus. Oh. So did you know the longer you hold on to the ledge or the higher percent you are when you grab the ledge you get less uh, the less invi invi invincibility you get so yeah that was smart yeah. the, to see that she was I'm at not, like higher percent I'm not even sure that's what happened I think uh, you well, think she dropped I've known that the uh, the hitbox reaches underneath oh you, no 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 but uh, I think if she was at zero she would have still had invincibility there yeah